once it was finally finished, the Death Star was the Emperor's favorite toy. It was also the most boring assignment in the galaxy for a stormtrooper. Tedious inspection drills, endless hours of guarding impregnable force field generators. Things got so bad that when a prison break erupted in the cell block, we were almost happy to have someone shooting at us again. If only we'd known what an embarrassing snipe storm we were about to wade into. We probably would have jettisoned the whole detention block into space. Attention, Hangar 84G. There is a prison riot in progress. A contingent of the 501st is inbound from an exterior inspection. Join up with the squad mates in the hangar and quell this riot. Rebel forces are converging on Hangar 84G. We cannot allow any of them to escape. Defend the hangar. Well done. 
The plans have been secured. The prisoners have captured the fire control room. You must not allow them to damage the main cannon.
time of the raid on Polis Massa, the men of the 501st were starting to get a little sick of the so-called rebellion. In the past, we'd secretly enjoyed putting down a local insurrection or two. They kept the troops sharp and the empire feared. But these rebels were different. They were organized, they were growing, and they were everywhere. The raid on Polis Massa was a perfect example of how things were starting to fall apart. We were supposed to go and wipe out a small band of rebels and recover some stolen imperial plans on an encrypted holodisc. Before we knew it, we were nearly overrun by rebel forces. The holodisc can only to be found. All right, men, Lord Vader wants this raid done by the book. Now, our first objective is the comm center, just beyond this hangar. Thank <laughs> you. 
have a data bank that holds Imperial encryption codes that can be used to eavesdrop on our ship-to-ship -ship communications. Make your way to the cabins and destroy the data bank. Watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to this channel for future gaming content. Also, consider visiting my website. I have my regular website, and then I have a designated gaming website. Also, consider supporting me on Patreon. Your donations there can really help me to improve my channel. A lot that includes getting new video games. In addition, you may also consider following me on Twitch along with other social media accounts. I do sometimes do some Twitch streaming, not too often. And before I let you go, have a good day, a good night, wherever you are, play video games. <laughs>